Universal Parcel Services, also known as UPS, is an American multinational package delivery company. With a CSR, rating of 56% and named one of the world's most ethical organization for the 10th consecutive year. But are they really ethical? Let's find out. How about we start with some unethical issues our team discovered. Firstly, we look at illegal delivery to avoid high tax. UPS was locked in a legal battle with the government after it was discovered that the company made illegal deliveries. A notable one was, smuggled cigarettes, to avoid high tax on classified goods. This led to the organization paying a fine of 40 million US dollars. The state of New York and city authorities have taken United Parcel Service Inc. UPS.in to trial this Monday, asking a federal judge to make the company pay more than $872 million. The settlement is due to UPS allegedly making illegal deliveries of more than 683,000 cartons of untaxed cigarettes. The non-jury trial before a federal judge in Manhattan came in a lawsuit by New York Attorney General Eric Schneiderman and New York City as part of the state's ongoing efforts to combat smuggling of cigarettes from lower tax areas. A lawyer representing the city told the judge that UPS ignored red flags that many of its shipments from American Indian reservations held untaxed cartons of cigarettes. The company also submitted false delivery claims to the federal government over next day or overnight packages. Secondly, UPS had issues with their employees. UPS may not be an ethical as first thought. One issue that has rocked the organization and is still embedded in their DNA is discrimination and racism. Reports shows that the company had singled out and harassed African-American workers which led to protest and civil rights lawsuits. Now, a CBS 46 investigation. Atlanta-based UPS says its secret business plans have been exposed by a high-level employee, and the company is now going to federal court to try and out them. The chief investigative reporter, Jonathan Carlson, is the CBS 46 bulldog. He is learning new details tonight about this still-developing corporate scandal. Jonathan, tell us more. Yeah, hey there, Sharon. Uh, lots of people talking about this. Sources within the rank and file tell me pilots at UPS are on edge tonight as the company's attorneys are aggressively hunting who did this. Shipping giant UPS dealing with an internal crisis. The Atlanta-based company is accusing a pilot of wrongfully obtaining what they call highly confidential strategic plans about their aircraft fleet and splashing the documents on internet message boards visited by other pilots. The leaker's motive unknown. Tales. Melinda? Yeah, that's right. Suspicious packages are nothing new, but police in Londonderry caught a man who was trying to pick up a package with narcotics inside. What he didn't know is that these police officers dressed up as UPS folks and got him in disguise as well. Police say two men were involved in receiving a package containing drugs at this UPS facility in Londonderry next to the airport. UPS told police they were unable to deliver that package to a home in Keene last Friday because it looked suspicious. Inside was a rubber whitewater raft. That was actually what drew the attention. Uh, it was kind of suspiciously uh, wrapped. Um, so that was the initial thing that seemed a little off.
Thank you.